If your cat's liver is no longer detoxifying properly, it can result in the eventual death of your beloved furry friend. Therefore, it is important to take your furry friend to the vet when you notice the first signs. But what are the symptoms of liver damage and how do you recognize them? We'll tell you now. Number 1. Loss of Appetite One sign that your cat's liver is no longer detoxifying is loss of appetite. This means that your furry friend is eating less, leaving food in their bowl, and no longer begging for food or treats. It may even be that they refuse to eat altogether. The reason for this is that the liver is involved in digestion. If the liver is not functioning properly, important digestive enzymes are no longer produced, resulting in slow and incomplete digestion of food. This causes discomfort and reduces the desire for food. Number 2. Vomiting. The disrupted digestion can cause the cat's gastrointestinal tract to become upset, resulting in nausea and vomiting. Another cause of vomiting and liver damage is the inability to break down toxins in the body. To get rid of the toxins, the digestive system reacts with vomiting. Number 3. Diarrhea. Just as disrupted liver function can cause vomiting, diarrhea can also be a possible symptom. This is also caused by disrupted digestion and is also a reaction to toxins that can no longer be broken down by the liver. Number 4. Weight loss and nutrient deficiency. Loss of appetite alone can lead to significant weight loss in your cat. If vomiting or diarrhea occur, or both, your furry friend can lose weight quickly. In addition, their entire body is damaged as it is unable to absorb enough vitamins and minerals that it needs. Number 5. Recurrent Constipation The symptoms of liver damage can be diverse, and so instead of diarrhea, recurring constipation can also occur. This is because digestion is slowed down due to the lack of digestive enzymes. It is also possible for diarrhea and constipation to alternate. Number 6. Jaundice. Jaundice, also known as icterus in medical circles, is a yellowish discoloration of the skin, eyes, and mucous membranes. The cause is that too much of the yellow pigment bilirubin is present in the body. This is produced when red blood cells die, releasing the red blood pigment hemoglobin. Normally, the bilirubin produced in this way is broken down by the liver, but since it can no longer function properly, the yellow pigment remains in the body and causes visible discoloration. Number 7. Excessive drooling. Another possible symptom is increased drooling. Since the liver regulates many hormones and messengers in the body, saliva production can also be disrupted by impaired liver function. Due to the excessive production of saliva, it flows uncontrollably from the cat's mouth. If they are already anorexic, it will further destroy their appetite. Number 8. Poor Wound Healing In addition to detoxifying and regulating digestion, the liver also has other important functions. Among other things, it produces blood clotting factors, which are essential for wound healing. Therefore, injuries will not heal but rather reopen and continue to bleed. This is very uncomfortable for the cat in the case of small injuries, and life-threatening in the case of larger ones, because without the liver's essential blood clotting factors, they could bleed to death. Number 9. Bleeding into the mucous membranes. Blood clotting factors are not only important for wound healing, but also necessary for the stability of blood cells. Liver damage can therefore lead to blood cells bursting upon minimal contact or even on their own. The areas of the body where the skin is very thin, such as the mucous membranes, are particularly susceptible to this. You can recognize bleeding by small red dots in the oral cavity, nose, or on the sensitive paw pads. In the eyes, the entire white of the eye may even turn reddish. Number 10. Dull, lifeless fur. A cat's fur should normally shine and feel supple. If it looks dull and brittle, it is a warning sign that your furry friend's liver may no longer be detoxifying properly. On the one hand, their body is heavily burdened by the toxins, which affects their fur. On the other hand, 
the liver is crucially involved in the absorption of essential fat-soluble vitamins by the body. These include vitamins A, E and D, which have significant effects on the health of the fur. Number 11, Fever. Elevated temperature can arise from several reasons with liver damage. On the one hand, the liver is involved in regulating body temperature. If it is no longer functioning properly, it cannot fulfill this task and body temperature rises. On the other hand, fever may be due to inflammation of the liver. It is also possible that the fever arises from poisoning because the liver can no longer break down the toxins. Number 12, Dehydration. Dehydration, or the drying out of the body, is a symptom of liver damage that is life-threatening on its own. Dehydration occurs on the one hand immediately due to the disturbed liver function, as the liver can no longer produce the necessary messenger substances for fluid exchange. On the other hand, the body also dehydrates due to frequent vomiting and diarrhea. Number 13, Discolored Urine. You should also keep an eye on your furry friend's urine. If their liver is no longer detoxifying properly, the urine may be mixed with blood. You can recognize this by a reddish color. The excretion of blood has several causes that can be attributed to liver damage. One reason is that toxins are not broken down and therefore damage the kidneys. As a result, they do not work properly and allow red blood cells to pass through unfiltered into the urine. Another cause is the decreased blood clotting, which leads to bleeding of the mucous membranes. The blood in the urine may also come from the fact that the red blood pigment of dead blood cells is no longer broken down by the liver. If the urine is not reddish but unusually dark, this can also be a sign of liver damage, but it is an indirect consequence. Dark urine is due to dehydration in your cat. Number 14, Discolored Stool. Just like urine, your furry friend's stool can give you clues as to whether their liver is no longer detoxifying properly. As with the skin and mucous membranes, this is reflected in a yellowish color of the stool. But black or red stool is also an alarm signal. This indicates that your cat has bleeding in the digestive tract, which can be attributed to a disturbed blood clotting. Number 15, Enlarged Liver. In the case of liver damage, your cat's liver can be significantly enlarged. You can recognize this by a swelling in the abdominal area that you can feel clearly. If your furry friend's liver is swollen, this is a serious warning sign of inflammation of the liver tissue and bile ducts. It may also be a fatty liver or liver tumor. In any case, if your cat's liver is already swollen, you must not waste a second and take her to the vet immediately. Number 16. Fatigue and Apathy Liver damage is a significant burden on the body, and as a result, the sick cat is often tired. She sleeps more frequently and longer, becomes quickly exhausted during activities, and generally appears lethargic. Cats with a liver that is no longer fully detoxifying, sometimes lie only in their baskets and do not want to get up. They no longer have the drive to play and run around because they feel too unwell and are too exhausted to enjoy physical activity. Number 17, Nervous System Disorders. Since the liver also contributes to the proper functioning of the nervous system, liver damage can lead to severe nervous disorders. The brain is also affected. The disorders of the nervous system are noticeable both physically and in behavior. There is strong muscle tremors, spasms, balance problems, and disorientation. Even comatose states can occur. In behavior, both aggressiveness and anxiety can be observed. If you notice any of the symptoms mentioned, do not hesitate and take your cat to the vet immediately. Many of the described symptoms can have causes other than liver damage, but in any case, they can be warning signs of a severe illness. Whether your furry friend's liver is no longer detoxifying or there is another illness, only the vet can determine. Are you still interested in learning what your cat does when she has heart problems? Then click on the left picture to find out in our video. Instead, do you want to know the 7 surprising signs that your cat is in pain? Find out with a click on the right picture.